We've got a 700 cow organic dairy herd. We also have nearly 3,000 free range laying hens as well. When we bought the farm in 2008, there was some nightens planted here in an arrangement with guns. And in about 2018, we harvested those trees. Once we'd actually harvested the trees, we didn't know what the next step was. And that's when we got in touch with Private Forest Taz to, to see if we could get some advice. And that's how this all came about. So last year we planted 40,000 trees here, a mixture of nightens and radiata pines. Honestly, we don't feel qualified ourselves to plant trees. We engaged a firm of contractors to do most of the work, apart from this fencing that we've done. I was amazed at just how productive those guys were. Within the space of about three days, they'd come in and done the whole job. As far as the shelter belts go, we were quite strategic where we put them. We looked for places that were exposed where they would have the most beneficial effect. It's probably hard to measure a financial benefit from it, but we're convinced that there are benefits to having more biodiversity on the farm, provide some genuine level of shelter for the livestock, and reducing the evaporation by slowing the wind down across the farm should have some benefits as well. But also, from an aesthetic point of view, just make the farm more attractive too. So we're really positive about putting trees on farms. Um, we think that there are lots of places that are not suitable for potentially grazing livestock and that type of thing. Gullies, steep areas, you know, corners that are difficult that would really benefit from having trees in there, both as an economic crop, but also for the utility value and the biodiversity benefits as well. And so that's why I think doing something like this and becoming a demonstration site has been not only valuable to us, but I think it, it hopefully is valuable to other farmers as well, so they can see that it's quite possible to do it. The information, the resources are out there. What we were able to access in terms of expertise from PFT was huge. And I think that had we not have got in touch with them, I'm not sure what we would have actually done, whether we'd even have trees in there yet. So, so yeah, it was really, really valuable.